Hey kids, welcome back to the channel. My name is Edgar and if you guys enjoy my content, please subscribe. It would help me a lot. So getting straight to the point, today I want to talk about this couple who went on second chance and the, the guy is asking uh, his ex-girlfriend for a second chance. So without wasting any time, let's roll the clip. I met Corbin when I was still in college. We vibed right away. It was hard to do long distance. We wanted to make it work, but there was just too much jealousy. Eventually, I suspected that Corbin was cheating on me. So I hired someone to seduce him. But I never cheated. I miss her, and I think if we can trust each other, we can really have something special. I want to see if she'll give us a second chance. So are you ready to be honest and tell me that you're cheating on me? <laughs> Is that how we're going to start this off? Yeah, that is it. We haven't talked about it yet. I didn't cheat on you. I know that you did. How do you know this? Because the girl you cheated with, I paid her 50 bucks to hit on you. Why would you pay a girl to talk to me? That's some crazy <laughs> You were giving off horrible energy, and it had a series of events leading up to that. A series like of events? Like you flirting with other girls, you eyeing other girls. Who would getting... I ever flirt with? Oh my gosh, all the girls at your gym? You're not at the gym, so how can you say I'm flirting with On Instagram. With them? I've seen it. What do you mean? You're over there liking all these girls' Instagram pictures, your workout buddies with all these different girls at your gym, and you're literally posting thirst traps, like, ab pics, like, ah, uh, like. I'm a trainer. I have a fitness Instagram. So when I see other people that have fitness okay, pages, so you're gonna it's like, called oh, building them up. Oh, sexy girl, oh, whatever. You're so sexy, you're gonna like that? It's yeah. for work. It's innocent flirting and help me get clients to continue to make money. What is, like, respectful in a relationship? Like, Trusting the person guys. and not paying somebody to see if they would cheat. But it happened. Not true. You went on a date with this girl. It wasn't a date. She literally told me that you took her out to eat. No. Yeah, and you guys hooked up. You can't sit here and deny that. I am denying because it's not true. It, okay. Sure. She's a client, and after we were working out, we got food, which was across the street. That's where not we what walked. she told me. <laughs> That's what I'm telling you. <laughs> she told you. me you guys had sex. I'm telling you, we didn't. So, are you saying she's lying? I'm saying she's lying. She's Let's lying. find out from her. Okay. So, who is right. lying? Who is, who is lying? Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> Paula, can you tell him what you told me? So, I pretty much told her that you took me to this really fancy restaurant and afterwards we went back to my place and hooked up. And that he came on to you in the car and you guys were kissing? Yes. Yeah, see? Well, why would you sit here and lie? I lied because... Oh, so you weren't telling wait. the truth? <laughs> I didn't think that she deserved you, so I lied. We're oh my God. Clearly she doesn't value the faithful, amazing man that you are. Jesus. I thought, you know, maybe Jesus. I have a chance because- So you thought you had a chance with him, so you're trying to homewreck us so that you can be with him? Wow. Thanks. <laughs> she lied to my face. And what have I been saying? All right, well, oh. I'm sorry for doing that and making it go that far instead of talking to you about it. When I feel like someone's pulling away, I'll just pull away too. We were long distance, and I see you liking all Instagram girls' pictures, and you were not texting me as much, not calling me. I was working a lot, but that doesn't mean I was cheating on you. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I mean, I appreciate your apology. What is that? It takes a lot to apologize, especially, you know, after all of that. I, I didn't fully understand, you know, everything that was going on. But now that I do, you know, it clearly makes sense as to why you are so upset. And it really just comes down to a communication issue. Mm -hmm. You know, and that doesn't seem like a good enough reason to throw everything that we had away. I miss you so much. Yeah, I miss you a lot. You're awkward. <laughs> I want you to give us a second chance. <laughs> Honestly, you're so cute. I feel like I should be asking you for the second chance after all of this bull****. <laughs> uh. So is that a yes? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I want to try again. Wow. <laughs> Man, I love this show. Wow! <laughs> like, what just happened in that? Like, okay, do actually do women actually do this? You hire a girl to seduce your boyfriend so that you find out if he's cheating or is it this? These stories are wild. These stories are so wild. Like, 
what do you guys think? Should should he actually give her a second chance? Like I, I was happy when they got to the end and uh, and they they seem like they've missed each other and it's 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 mutual. They actually had feelings for each other. But there were so many red flags when this story started with her being so insecure that he's on Instagram and he's a trainer and that he's talking to clients and he flirts a little or, or is flirting disrespectful in a relationship what do you guys think this this story actually blew me away but like i'm afraid for them she seems like she had so much insecurities and in this story it's it's not just her fault because when you feel insecure it's also the other person who are doing who are actively doing things that make you feel insecure and I really wish them the best. I hope they can make it work. Or maybe they'll come on the show again and I'll do another YouTube video about it. Because <laughs> we're all about the tea here. We're all about the tea. So guys, write your comments down there. Give me your thoughts. Let's let's talk about it. And subscribe if you like my content. Because uh, I, I don't sleep. I don't sleep. I'm always just making these videos, guys, for you. So that's all from me for today. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.